the Dao Yin 12 movement Qigong. It's an absolutely beautiful, elegant, elaborate form. This particular form put together by the Chinese Health Qigong Association in their book, which is fabulous, by the way. They say um, that this is easy to learn. No, it's not. <laughs> it's really hard to learn. And you're going to need workshops, classes, video, book. However, uh, follow along and just enjoy how beautiful and different these movements are. So the main thing is listen to your body, just flow and enjoy. And if you get a bit of left-right wonkiness, doesn't matter. Just keep flowing. Just enjoy the beautiful moves. Let's start. I'm going to read the rhyme. Starting, hands on your dantian, one hand on top of the other. For women, it's the right hand underneath, men, it's the left. Stand there, relax, close your eyes, dispel all thoughts in the deep night, concentrate the mind on the dantian. Breathe slowly to build a magpie bridge. Let the body fly like a swallow in the clouds. Opening your eyes. Ready? Lowering the hands. And let's begin. Beginning of heaven's creation. Rolling the arms inwards, keep it comfortable. And sink. Circling, straighten your arms. Follow the hands. Easing up. And to the other side. Straight arms only rolling in as much as is comfortable. Sink. Moving on, double fish hung on the wall. Turning left, left palm up, left foot forward. Put the fingers on the pulse point here. Circle, spin around. Laogong points facing each other. Bit of a slide, stretching. And now follow that hand down, continue flowing. Now we've got right hand up, right foot forward, circle around, spinning on that point there. Just a little slide, we're making that beautiful yin yang sign. Old horse is stabled, sinking. Comfortable horse riding stance. Fists. Stretch out, feel the upper back muscles working. As we sink, we're looking left. Form your hooks, straight arms. Bring them around. You have a snap of the fingers. Stretch. Shifting your weight. Easing up. Sinking, forming the fists, forearms together if you can. Stretch, sinking, we're looking right this time. Straight arms, bring them around, snapping, stretch, and ease up. Next block of three, we come from this position and we repeat them twice, stepping out. Ji Chang shoots a louse up and forwards, forming fists. Shifting your weight, push the heel, draw the bow. Palms open, 
adjust your foot then you can shift your weight easing up bringing the palms back to the waist sink stepping out fingers up then forwards fists again we're pushing into the center of the palm push the heel draw back the bow palms down adjust the left foot before you shift your weight onto it easing up and doing that one again extending the arms forwards and we're pushing the acupressure point on the ball of the foot into the ground as we turn the bubbling well adjust it again bring the fists up notice how extended the arms are they're fairly straight turn as far as is comfortable draw back palms down but as they come around arms quite straight and now sinking bending the body to brush the shoes rotating the arm turning to look at it straight fingers are looking up beautiful move pulling down to the shoulder and now pressing massaging the acupressure points all the way down across sweep across the shoes turn the palm forming your fist and slowly rise pressing down and out and then rotate we've got gentle rotation through the whole body lowering press stroking the meridians if you can't get to your feet doesn't matter just sweep your hand across as at whatever height you get to form the fist and lift Ending. Really focusing on that hand. As we sink, drawing the core in to support the back. While we do that, we are still breathing. Just making sure you're not holding your breath when you're down there. Very easy to do. Turn. Sweep across, brush away the dust. Relax. The rhinoceros gazes at the moon. Empty stance now shift your weight again pivot on the ball of the foot and looking up at the moon unwind those arms adjust the foot again arms are quite extended turn them and lower sinking first no weight on the foot shifting and turn Unwind the palms. This lovely rotation through the arms. Aiming for smoothness here, sinking. Also notice there's a bit of wrist movement. Neutral wrist as we come back. But as we start sinking, a bit of extension and then flexion of the wrist. Push the heel, 
coming back, adjusting the foot. And lower. The lotus flower rises above the water. Here we've got our cross-legged sit. Stepping out, snap. Stretch, lovely stretch. Form fists. We're looking left. Tuck the foot behind. Sink. Here are our lotus root arms. Bring the hands. Here's our lotus flower rising. Keep looking at it. Opening, shifting the weight and ease up. The lovely visuals with this one. Stepping out. Stretch, open. Forming the roots, twisted roots in the mud. Heels of hands together, lift, pushing with both feet, stretching up, shifting your weight and easing up. Golden rooster heralds the dawn, forming hooks. Lift the heels, looking left, release the hooks, flow. Now we're taking that left leg back, bend at the knee, just lift as far as you can, put it down with control, easier said than done. Now looking right, and flow. Now the right leg back, make your muscles work. And lower. Wild geese land on the beach. Lifting your wings. Turning again. Cross-legged crouch. Only sink as far as is comfortable. Stretch out. Lifting. Softening your wings. Sink once more. Keep breathing. Feet together. Recover. Before we do that one again, lift, tuck the foot behind. Extending. And focusing on the center of the palm here. Draw in. Pressing. And lower. White crane flies high in the clouds. Lift your toes, run the hands up your sides, pivot, sweep forward and open. Ready to lift the heels. Here we are, flying high and lower and again we're stimulating the acupressure points as we come up and the hand as well as the ribs open notice the wrist action tilting up and lower Phoenix salutes the people, turning a little, sweeping the arms around, rotating as we do so, turn, forming hooks, straight arms, sink back, bring the hands around, open, stretch. Pressing back, rotating the arms. So we arrive there, palm up to the corner that is, and then turn. 
straight arms form the hooks sink back crossing and open ease up chi and breath return to the origin sweeping around we're directing the chi into the dantian This time keep the legs straight, bring the hands onto the Dantian, sweep around once more, bringing the palms in and right hand under for women, left for men and finishing off the red dragon stirs the sea. In this case, the red dragon is your tongue and circle it around vertically. Three times one way, three times the other. We are stimulating the production of saliva here. Have a play. And then take three gulps to swallow it. Clear, direct gulp. Up. I hope you enjoyed that beautiful form.